Hi everyone, it's Ryan, another episode of Stay Awesome, and today I want to talk about how I stepped in some Facebook poo today. I ended up stepping in a big pile of Facebook crap because I made a comment somewhere and somebody took offense to it. Okay, I'm actually being a little flippant about it, but I thought there was a good lesson in this experience, and so I thought I'd talk about it today because even though my comment wasn't necessarily meant to be insensitive or mean-spirited directed towards one person, in fact, it was more or less a sarcastic comment, other people who don't know me read it the wrong way, and unfortunately, it caused them to be a little upset with me. It all started with a, a friend, more an acquaintance, we've met a couple times, but we know each other from university. He was posting about how he feels like people at work don't take him seriously, and he resents being called junior when he's put in his time, and so he was talking about that. I made a f really flippant comment, you know, saying that, why don't you just turn it back on the people? Thank the elders for mentoring you while their bodies fail them a little bit more every day and that they can pass on their wisdom before they forget it while death creeps and stalks forward a little bit more every day. It was meant to be sarcastic and when I typed it out I was hoping that it would be sarcastic in the sense that I was responding to something that my friend said and that this is something that you could say in kind of a, a jest. And unfortunately it kind of blew up a little bit. The comments down below there was a couple people who took it seriously saying that you know you should be thankful for the the elders who've gone before you and have sacrificed their bodies for the betterment of the profession. One person said that if I'm not a, a you know, person in this industry that you know I don't really have a leg to stand on. I'm not actually sorry for what I said mostly because I was being flippant about it and it was in response to something that my friend had said. Uh, I do feel bad that some people took it the wrong way, and I'm not saying that they shouldn't have taken it the wrong way, or that in any way this was on their in their fault. I just happened to make the wrong comment, and I, as an outsider, don't have a context for, for what goes on in the profession. And so when an outsider is making a comment, it's obviously going to be taken the wrong way. So I kind of was reminded of a little thing. I mean, we see this a lot when people are making comments outside of their domains, but in general, this is kind of a good thing to keep in mind that it's not about staying in your lane. It's more about being sensitive to factors that are beyond what you may or may not be aware of. Words do matter. And there are things that you're not aware of that when you make these comments, other people are going to be affected by them. I checked in with my buddy to say that I, you know, I apologize that if I've blown anything up or made anything harder for you and actually he he was fine with it he, in fact he had messaged me first to say that he hoped that nothing that any of his colleagues had said had offended me and to be honest no I mean I did have that first initial troll instinct to like dig my heels in and fire back some, something snarky but in the end I didn't think it was very productive to the conversation I was just trying to make my buddy laugh with a little bit of maybe a little bit of dark humor, not realizing that that those dark humors or at least the things that I said could be playing into real fears that other people might be having. And so I stepped in a little bit of Facebook poo poo this morning, but it is what it is. It's just a good reminder for me to ma make sure I pay attention that context matters and that sometimes there's a culture that I am not privy to. And that when I make comments as an outsider, it may not be taken the best way. You can't be awesome all the time, but it's good to at least be mindful of those lessons and kind of remind yourself along the way, be a good person, try not to be negative, uh, and always strive to be awesome. Anyways, take care.